What's going on YouTube? Geosno right here. So in today's video we have some updates about the Cheo Chilbrick for iOS 15.0 up to 15.1.1 on the A12 and newer devices. So Coolstar has posted a few important things that we need to keep in mind, but before that it's important to understand the context. This video is brought to you by Starsoft KeyPass, a software that allows you to unlock the iPhone lock screen and activation lock on iPhone 10 and older. The program is available for both Windows and Mac OS and a free trial is available. So if your device is unable to be activated because it says could not activate or unable to activate or it's in lowest mode or even if you forgot your Apple ID and password or you bought a second hand device that turned out locked, you can check out KeePass in the link below. The program also supports iPhone is disabled or forgotten passcode and so on, so check the program out in the link below. So I'm sure you remember the Cheo jailbreak by the ODC team and Coolstar and so on. It's basically a jailbreak for iOS 15.0 up to 15.1.1 that was announced a couple of months ago and is currently in development. Now a lot of the development has been slowed down by the fact that the community is essentially pretty bad towards Coolstar. They've been transphobic and of course they've been pretty disrespectful overall towards developers like Coolstar. So at some point Coolstar decided to stop working on it and only work on it when they have the time and the drive to work on it. So the development has been very slow but that's not the only reason. Another reason for the delays has been the fact that LibHooker needed to be updated so essentially the Tweaks substrate had to be updated, but also the way that tweaks work and the way that tweaks are compiled. For example, Theos, which is used to compile tweaks on iOS, it's I think one of the biggest components for tweak development, is not updated to support the rootless format. So some updates had to be done to Theos as well to support LibHooker and the new rootless format, which is still ongoing. Tweaks have to be updated as well for the rootless format and for LibHooker. So currently Chaot works, but no tweaks are running because no tweaks have been updated. Coolstar has achieved SSH though, so it's a great jailbreak for development purposes, and today they announced this. Quote, at everyone, if developers and some users are interested in the 15.0 to 15.1 jailbreak without tweaks, but it has SSH and can run Cilio and has Chaot recovery, that is something that could be potentially released in a short time, as current Chaot has that. Offering this, as some people pointed out nicely, that it might be useful while LibHooker is refactored and made ready. The refactor is what's currently in progress. Also, if you supported Chaot's development and you want in on this, let me know. Just be aware that this isn't very stable on A15 and I don't know why. Teamstar tried running it on A15 and it shut itself, though he did try forcing tweaks, though it works reliably on A13. So it looks like Coolstar might actually release the Chaot jailbreak in the current state, which is essentially having SSH running and Cilio and Chaot recovery, which makes for a great developer jailbreak for a great research jailbreak, which can be used to further update people's tweaks and stuff like that. Once tweaks are updated, she will actually push an update to contain tweak support and stuff like that. But if people are interested, she might release chair jailbreak with SSH and stuff like that in a very short time, as she says in here. So if you people are interested in the current chair jailbreak, she could actually release it the way it is right now. Even though tweaks don't currently work, you will have SSH and Cilio and stuff like that, and you will be able to tell that there there is a real jailbreak for iOS 15, at least in development. Twix will still take some time to be developed because LibHooker has to be updated, but of course that can be done. So all that's left realistically for Chaot is the update to LibHooker, which can take some time, but Coolstar said she could release the jailbreak in the current status if people want it. So yeah, let me know in the comments below. Thank you for watching, I am Gia Snow, peace out.